<laughs> he is one of me now. Dude, this is hilarious. This is the only way this could have looked any stupider is if I somehow could join with a dolphin diving cop. What is going on guys? Ryan here playing some Grand Theft Auto 5 modded. Now I'm just, I, I just, full disclosure, I haven't, I haven't messed with any mods in Grand Theft Auto in a legit almost a year, if not a year already. So I decided it was time to hop back in here and see what's been going on. And I was just trying to get this one mod going, which I had to download and install some other previous mod to acquire it. And just somewhere in the entire mix, I, I don't know what the hell went wrong. <laughs> Something... Something definitely went very wrong, but now I am a, um, a door with Iron Man powers. So this is my life right now, guys. I don't know how the fuck it happened, what I did to deserve this almighty power and responsibility. But this is what we're looking at now. A freaking door with Iron Man powers. So I figured, instead of just messing with it, trying to fix it, and actually do what I was trying to do, Alert, that I could just... Coming. Oh shit, thanks Jarvis. Jarvis works for doors also. I figured we could just... Oh, I did actually want to get the cops on me right now. I wouldn't go ahead and make my own version of Captain America Civil Door. Like, if it was just... Honestly, the whole thing worked out more perfect than if I had planned it. I, like, am the most inexperienced modder in the freaking world, so yeah, it's just it's just how things ended up. I ended up as a door. I don't know what the hell. I have no idea where the fucking door even came to place in that, but it's... It's how I'm living life right now. So without being a law-breaking criminal, since we're supposed to be the Captain America of this whole thing, I figured we would just try and live a civil life, at least for a minute. I've never seen a door with superpowers try and live a normal life in Grand Theft Auto before. So before getting rid of this special gift Doth Dao God gods have given me, tongue twisted the shit out of myself. You, you'd be perfect. Oh, I'd love to ride a motorcycle as a freaking door. Fly, stupid! You know what I mean? Come on. <laughs> All right, I'm still getting the hang of this whole flying door thing. So, yeah, shit, you're gonna have to excuse me. Die, you dirtbag! I really can't see anything either. It's the only downside. You block the hell out of your vision. <laughs> this is exactly how a door would run. This is a beautiful thing right here. Alright, there we go. Now once I lose the cops, I'm gonna try and live my life as a normal door. Just, um, just opening and closing for people. Actually, I don't want to be a pushover door, though. I want to be like a, an artificial intelligence door. Okay, it's gonna be hard to lose these cops without dipping into our powers, but... Just because I have no general incentive to, I want to blow them up. But no, we're trying to be Captain America Civil Door over here. It's got it as a bad start. Nicely done, sir. Oh, hell yeah. Thanks, Jarvis. Dude's a homeboy. Okay, so... I think the first thing about... Now, for those of you who don't know, I haven't mentioned it in a video in like over a year and a half or something. Actually, since I mentioned it, so many YouTubers have moved to LA, so now I'm sure that, um... I've just been born and raised here, but I'm sure that... Okay, you know it's a sad world. It's a four-way intersection. Only there are greenlit. I'm the only one being civil here. Look at this asshole. Oh my god. You know it's a bad world when doors have more manners than people. Alright, green light for us now. See, this is... This is nice. Oh my god, it was barely green. Is that sucker gonna run it? Jesus Christ. If this was actually... See you. You slow down on yellow. If this was actually LA, then cops do not... You literally... Cops do not fuck around around here. They will pull you out of your vehicle for running a red light. <laughs> The lady, that's, that's just not cool. Okay, I'm starting to see why everyone just speeds through stuff. It's because every light is a red light. This is bullshit. Come on, everyone's breaking the law. It's a red light, you dumbass. Even the cops breaking the goddamn law. No one has any respect for anything around here. It's just stupid being a door and trying to be civil. Civil door was not as a reason this movie never... Another red light. Holy shit. Who is the traffic guy behind all this? We need to get to the bottom of this. Freaking hydras. Oh, dude, what's the busy even in my lane? Oh, this is just frustrating trying to play this game normally. Everyone's such a dick. There we go. Finally. Now, you may get your ass kicked in LA, but actually, you no, know, people are horrible on the road. There's constant accidents. Oh, and there's finally a green light. But at least we know when to break down. Everything I'm saying right now is so false. LA is such a horrible place to drive. All right, see? Break on, break on yellow. There we go, we just had to get out of the action zone. Everyone's kind of, nope, nope, no one knows what the fuck is going on here either. This is exactly the kind of shit to make a door go vigilante. Like, this is it right here. This is the tale of door, b-holes? I haven't played this game in a while. I miss all the perverted ass shiz everywhere. Okay, but for real. Thank the lords, oh my God. If this is a red light up ahead, then civil door is coming to, okay, yeah. Screw this shit right here, okay. Right. Let's watch this guy kind of limp around for a little bit. 
Clearly something correct happened here. Like, it was a total accident how I ended up a door, but I mean, we have total door walking motions. So I think this is specifically meant for, like, a door mod or something, but I don't know how the hell I ended up with it. Sweet! Yeah, once people start realizing a door is true potential, they fucking step lively. Yeah, son! Alert. We have incoming. Why we have a couple darts and darts? Darts in us, I do not know. Oh, for real, son! You wanna fight a door? You ever even fought a door before? You don't know how to- you can't stand up against me. Freaking Redwood, bitch! <laughs> don't they stop? Piggies, huh? Where are the coppers? See, the coolest thing is just watching them from a distance stand back. Look at that. It's like, where did the beams even come from? How did I even end up this way? This is just firing off a machine gun. Alright, well when the cops come, things stop being as fun, so we're just gonna go ahead and skedaddle. Actually, you know what? Let's go down to the beach. I wanna swing by as a door and just kinda just hang line everybody. That'd be hilarious. There we go. Once it starts... Those aren't doors. Those are headphones. There's like headphones caught in our door. But yeah, once you're like a flat surface flying, that's when honestly you can weasel through more than anything in the world. Because you're just a... Oh my god! Well, you're not that flat. You're still a big ass door. Look at this home run swing. Yeah! That is too damn funny! No parking. It didn't say anything about no doors. Let's go. So I feel like this door is up to some sketchy ass shit. If I ever just saw a door just sprinting down, I don't know if I'd run with him or run away from him. Like, clearly he could be up to some evil shit, but whatever is making doors reanimate as living creatures and run away might be a lot worse. I got some, like, some sort of mega rapist around the corner. Got our individual hand buff. I could just see what I was doing. Life would be so much better. Where are you, bastards? I don't even know what's going on here. Oh, damn, son. I thought we were just dancing. Oh, you have molded with us! Oh, you're screwed, dude. If you, if, is he coming with us for good? Because that would just be perfect. This is what it looks like when you're holding him. <laughs> he is one of me now. Dude, this is hilarious. This is the only way this could have looked any stupider is if I somehow could join with a dolphin diving cop. Look at that guy. Those are some perfect dolphin dives, though. Dude's got skills. Oh, you're coming with me, little one. I can't make it off the ground like this. America's finest right here. This is what we got going on. Okay, you're gonna shoot your fellow officer as well. I can't take off with him in my arms. It's killing me inside. I gotta leave you, buddy. Gotta leave you here. Whoa, shit! Sorry about that. Excuse me, sir. This door has superpowers. Okay, what was my ideal goal when I first came here? I guess the chest cannon's always the one you use. I don't have to worry about energy draining or no. No, 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 no. See, this right here, this is actually called Venice Beach in real life. I live about half an hour from here. I grew up down here. See, I didn't live down here when I grew up here, but my friends did, and I've seen some horrible shit on this beach. I was mentioning it in an ARC video, like, last month or something. But I went, one time I saw a homeless person literally on this thing, but I think not these bathrooms, the one that would be way down there that don't exist in the game, like, a quarter mile down the beach more. I, oh, these ones. Oh, Jesus Christ, I haven't played this. No, 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 it'd be the next one for sure, though, because it was farther. But I legit saw a homeless person pee, like crawling on the ground, piss, and shit their pants at the same time. That's when I learned not all homeless people are nice people, some are just drug addicts. But a lot of nice people. Alright, sucka. He just, he's now realizing the kind of door he just started a fight with. There we go. Oh, I can't see me being a door anymore though. Oh, shoot, I kinda liked that bit. See, I could've done this the whole time, but you're kinda missing out on the whole door aspect. Whatever. As long as we know we're we're wicker, everything's fine. What happened? Well, there's the door. We separated. That's dirty. There we go. I'm being a total noob with view and everything right now, just because I haven't played GTA in a long ass time. Okay, we're back to our door rights. This is how I, I hate to judge movies, but I think if Civil War included an actual door instead of Iron Man, it, it might have done a little better. <laughs> People are way bigger fans of doors. That's just, I don't know who's freaking out, taking that all seriously, just kidding, we all, we all love Iron Man more than doors, don't worry. You're about to get splattered by a freaking pound of wicker, son. This would be the most gangster shit ever if we could fly under cars, since we are flat enough, but we're not, I think it still visualizes us as a very tall, or big Iron Man. 
This is what it's all about right here. This is exactly why I dusted off GTA 5. Even though you don't really dust off old games anymore, they're all on Steam. This right here, man, just to be an option of a super door. Okay, so Captain America Civil Door didn't last that long, and I realized that it lasted about 10 seconds. It wasn't... What the fuck even happened there? It wasn't my fault no one else obeys the law. I thought there was still at least some... Some common dignity in Grand Theft Auto. I didn't realize all civilians, literally 100% of them, I'm failing! We're douchebags. All right, this is Iron Door's last stand right here, because I am just... Cannot run from my problems any longer. Don't you mess with me, bitch. See, this is what Voldemort should have done. Voldemort should have taken over the world with a magical door. No one would have even suspected his ass. I don't know why I'm even thinking of that. I'm not even pressing anything. We're just being sucked into the ozone right now. Switch to chest beams. Oh, shit. Calm down, Jarvis. Oh, my God. Well, it's usually different with the Hulk to catch you. Come on. I still consider myself Iron Man. I don't care if I'm a door. <laughs> just because I'm horrible with mods doesn't mean I shouldn't enjoy myself. Right, where the hell are you, Jarvis? I mean, Jar Jarvis, fucking call him out, homeboy. Alright, a door can only take so much before it snaps, dude. Everyone knows this about doors. Yeah, bitch! Alright, where's another one? You, sir. I keep forgetting I'm Iron Man. I, <laughs> I know I just said, like, I only consider myself that. But you really forget you have certain powers when you're just a door floating around. No general point in life, like not even any... What even powers this damn thing? Should the government even be trying to kill this thing? I feel like they should be trying to capture it and freaking figure out where it gets its powers from. If this is what they could do with a door, imagine what they could do with everything else. Some evil forces at work here. This is a fucked up future right here when you gotta worry about random flying doors taking out airliners. Jesus Christ, I can't imagine this being an added risk in today's world. Everything else is already so scary. I mean, they would just add like an extra 45 minutes in the freaking metal detector line. Ooh, there's a door outside your window, bitch. I don't even know how to, how to process. <laughs> Mega door coming in. Yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. Not the water crap. Can we fly in the water? I've never been in the water as Iron Man before. Especially as a door. Oh my god, this sucks. Now we're just like a powerless door. Pretty much just, well, not, not powerless for the most part. Super power door. Ha ha ha, sucks to suck, bitch. Okay, now we're generally still just as powerful. I'm, I'm just tripping. See, now we're flying. Just at a fraction of the speed. Okay. So clearly, guys, never drop your magical door in the water. It loses just about all power. It's actually kind of pathetic. Suck it, nerd. Obviously, we all love the freaking chest cannon more than anything, but I'd say that the missiles are just the best for just dropping vehicles in this. Like, I'm still gonna continue to use the chest blast just because that's the most stylish for sure. But Grand Theft Auto ishically, this is the way to do it. I'm somehow just picturing some Thor, but instead of a magical hammer, he has a magical door, and it just flies to his ass wherever he is in the world at this exact speed and power. That'd be a horrible spin-off, but to be honest, I'd still watch it, because I can never get enough freaking superhero movies. Plus, I can imagine him kicking the shit out of somebody with a door. This is a heavy piece of wood right here. Very blocky. Oh my god, we were doing good! I need to buy your bicycle. Oh, come on, I quoted freaking Terminator. You better be on that thing. Oh, hell no, nah, girl. Hell no, nah, get out of here. Get out of here. Oh, no, I wish I had a pimped up, pimped up bike to use. Because this thing's going to crap out on me so quick. Screw you, bitches! Oh my god, come on. Cover all the fire. Damn it, they popped their tires. That's what I was worried about. We're not even worried. That's what I knew the inevitable was. Okay, you know what? Nonetheless, even we have a flat tire. We're a goddamn door riding a motorcycle down the highway. I think we're doing pretty good with life. Oh, crap. How do you disagree with this? This is some magical essence that humans should have aimed to acquire. Oh, not these goddamn things. There we go. Get out of here. I honestly can't understand the resistance humans are having right now to this magical door. This is exactly, exactly why aliens won't talk to us. Because they're going to whip out magical doors and we're going to flip a shit. Get out of here. Piss off. Damn it, why is there a Captain America mod? That was, I just need a homeboy right now. Okay, you know what? Y'all asked for it. I didn't mean to call in these goobers. I wanted to call in a door army. Whatever, at least now we have some defense going. 
Yeah, the magical door will take over the world one way or another. There we go. Oh man, I really should have put more time into what you guys would spawn as. I was just hoping they'd spawn as doors. Again, I have no idea how the fuck I became a door. It's just, just the most random thing of the day so far. Not even of the week. Games are always so damn weird to me. See, this is the way to do it. I'm just gonna go everywhere with my little army. This is about the most majestic I'm probably ever gonna feel. I mean, not gonna lie, flying around as, as Iron Man and all those guys, it's pretty damn cool, but this is, because this just makes you, just it just humbles you extremely. It makes you cut loose from being a human. You're just an inanimate object with infinite power. The freaking, it just blows my mind. It sounds like we're still getting the shit kicked out of us. No, not the water. Oh, thank God. Oh, well, now you've opened my eyes to a whole new world. <laughs> See, okay, if we can fly, see, I'll bet we can fly through. Can we? Oh, no, 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 I was about to try something that right when I do that, I crap out into the wall. Come on. Can we fly through little tiny areas in that bridge, or does it still register us as big-ass Iron Man? I don't think Iron Man can fly through this anyways, though. Damn it. It's true. It proves nothing. What about this? What about this? What about... Ooh, that was some thin-ass shit right there. That was like a baby condom. Boom. Okay, so that's pretty fancy. What about through this? Oh shit, we are legit as flat as a board right now. That is too cool. See, now we just have even more power. For some reason, being flat is power. It's like the opposite of high school. Oh shit, I got cocky. I think the only way this could have been better is if I accidentally made, oh damn, I thought I was gonna hang line him. Hang line, damn it. Is if I accidentally became a giant dildo with Iron Man powers. That's the only way I'd say this could be even topped. Dude, we are flying at incredible speeds. This is so much fun. Yeah, that's what I was trying to do. I wanted to see the remains of his corpse, though. I didn't want to just miss out on all the fun. Super door in your face. Damn. No way, dude. You just survived super door. You, sir. Oh, I should have. Should have let him live. He deserved it. All right, but I think I'm going to go ahead and end this video here since now I've just retired to full-on Iron Man things. The days of civil door are now behind me. So yeah, if you guys had a good time watching, make sure to smack that like button, subscribe for more comments Morning. down below if you want me to do more Grand Theft Auto, and have a nice day guys, peace!